All right, we are back into playing Devil May Cry, and we're going through the next two missions before we end the night. Probably, maybe, um, not. I'm not really quite sure yet, but we're definitely gonna get more work done on this game. Very excited, and my tags are gone. Like they're all gone. There we go. My tags are up and we're ready to go for Devil May Cry, Mission 7, United Front. We can get into it, it's gonna be good. Uh, good against strong flyers. Piercing beam attack, jockey. Wait, Jet Gadget, a punchline skill that allows the user to shoot the forearm as a guided missile. Okay, let's see, we just climbed in. That's interesting. Oh, there's a... Uh... Apparently I got another person next to me, I guess, playing. Who knows? Someone might be playing, uh... Uh... What's the word? He might be... They might be playing... Um... V for me, which is not too bad. I don't mind another person playing V. Hopefully someone's playing V for me. Or is it just two parallel playthroughs? I don't, I could, I can't find a way to fight with them. Guess I'll go ahead, you know. Cool, nice, nice, nice. What's in here? Nothing's in there. So, Rawhide's a good, like, AoE like for the close range that's not too bad gotta go upstairs because that is an option but look at that more orbs because i'm dying frequently for some reason okay let's go this way this way right, let's get started Oh cool, that's an attractive little beast. Just gotta cut its ribbons real quick. these guys to ribbons. Alright. High combos. Too bad. I like the way it cuts ribbons. I really like the way it ribbon cuts. When can you multiplayer? Is it after you beat the game that you can multiplayer? Or is it during the current progress that you can multiplayer?
Okay, I cut ribbons in the air. Okay, nope. Okay. Okay, cool, cool. No, okay. Can you can you not? I put everything into ribbons, because clearly I'm being surrounded by multiple enemies. Let's see, can I travel a little bit? What if I go into a fight without like any arms equipped? Wouldn't that be kind of fun? That's ragtime, okay. The electric bulbs are confusing. Okay, cool. Where is the infestation? Okay, cool. There we go. Attractive, we're good. We're attractive, we're fine. Starring Guru Guru thirty one, let's go. Ooh, Times Square. Oh boy, oh boy. Let's see. Gotta grab as much money as we can so we can upgrade all of our skills and then we use up all the devil breakers that we currently have. Yeah, so we, we're usually about with directions. Okay, I broke my arm. Can I not? You broke my arm, I swear to God. You're gonna pay for that. Can you can you come here real quick? Oh, 
I was dodging, excuse me. Can you, can you? Let's get a new arm that's behind us. I know there was an arm like left behind, but I, I want to pick it up. There's an arm. Oh, ragtime. That's not too bad. Cool. Let's go back real quick and get another arm because I am, I need a hand. Don't break your arm, Tyler. I'm running out of supplies. See, there's more arms back here. I think there's another arm back here, but I can't go back, can I? All right, this is the final destination for me. All right. I have four arms left, including ragtime. Okay, not too bad. So let's see. Oh, cool. I like that arm, too. All right, let's go, let's go, 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 Do 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 let's get stylish do 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 Okay Guess I'm going down Yes we are Oh you got it I think we're done crossing paths, I guess. Like, I want to cross paths and fight with the other guy, but, like... I don't want to go up there yet. There might be another armor I can use, you know? Like, we can be more equipped. What's this area? Cool, more supplies, more red orbs.
gotta gather as many of the secrets as I possibly can. So I got six arms right now, so I'm pretty good to fight then. another orb a golden orb this is what happens when you just look around you pick up things that people tend to leave behind and it gets all attractive all honky donky wonker donkers because the other idea you can do while playing this game is you know like Use actual money to buy more red orbs, which helps you buy more skills. But that also means you're depriving yourself of the joy of the fight that provides orbs. Fighting is not cheap and I need the skills to do it. Cool, interesting. There's Overture. Another armor could have used. But you know, I'm pretty good on orbs for now. On, uh. I'm pretty good on, uh, Double Breakers now. Or maybe I could have needed the help. Who knows? Wait, which way is the right way? Good, so I gotta go the opposite way to get more exploration done, you know? Like that. I need as much money as I, I can get in order to get upgrades for my character. Oh boy, hey look, it's me and, uh... It's me and Kyrie. Rise and Fall of Spencer. We're in a movie. Not a porn movie, but it's a movie. There a phone nearby. Because I really want to see how Nico is going to drive the car out to me this time. Because I'm always calling Nico, but I'm trying to figure out how does she even manage to get her the car like through what it does without like... Phone nearby. Oh, there's theater and arts right on the very edge of the tunnel. There's theater. Cool. 
What's on center stage, boys? What's at center stage, I mean? Look at you. Proto. Wait, Proto. Wait, Proto Angelo? Proto Angelo was from the first Devil May Cry game. That's so cool. Dark Knight Soldier Scudo Angelos. Nice. Getting the band back together, huh? What evil lurks? I must destroy. I thought that was the plan all along. But like the proto, the proto Angelo, those, those were enemies from back in Devil May Cry One, and that's so good for me that I love the, the nod to like Devil May Cry One. Okay, cool. Can you break the shield real quick? Just like find them real quick. Gotta break your arm real quick. Oh, that might be Dante also when you think about the big old sword and whatever. Shadow, can you not? Okay, cool. Cool. Time is Okay. 
can't. Can you die right? Oh god. Can you not hit touch me real quick? There we go. We're good to go. Was Proto Angelo actually Dante? That'd be pretty cool if it was because Angelo was the first real antagonist for Dante in the first Devil May Cry game. And maybe not. Theatrix was all he was for us. Unfortunately. But that could be a thing too, right? Tired already? I just remembered something. This town was attacked. Once before. Is that so? I was here. I can still see it. In fact, I was playing right here. That was the house. Interesting. This is where we part ways. You go ahead. You're gonna miss all the fun. No. I must seek out the Devil's Sword Sparta. What? Yeah, I don't think that's such a good idea. Trust me. You're not the only one who thinks so. But to win this fight, we're going to need all the help we can get. Not the only one. What the hell aren't you telling me? I mean, who knows? Maybe dear old dad wants you to beat him or whatever. Or maybe Dante needs the sword because, you know, Dante was interested with Force Edge in the beginning of the game in Devil May Cry 3, and he regains it in Devil May Cry 1. The timeline is so very just convoluted. You're stylish. You're super stylish. Chapter 8, The Demon King. Judging by a latest account, there's little chance that Trish and Dante made it out of the battle against the Demon King unscathed. Nero and V pressed on through the subway system to finally reach the roots of the Quilfoth. The ruins of an old house then prompts V to share his thoughts, which has only deepened Nero's suspicion. Who or what is V? V is an interesting character, because, you know, he's a guy who's uh, shrouded in a mystery. And there's Nico, as usual. Are you gonna hit me on purpose? I swear, I've made you pissed off at some point. Perfect timing. Now we're starting to act like a team. Ew, you like flirting with me? Knock it off. Get in the car. I mean, Nico is attractive for who she is. However, I got Kyrie. Wait, Nico is actually scared. She was actually scared the entire time. That was actually pretty cute. That she was low-key scared throughout the entire drive. She's, oh my god. I, I really like Nico. She's like low-key cute. But I don't know if she was like, if she was stampering because of Nero or she was stampering because of the fact that she did some work. But let's definitely... Should I just go into the mission with the with the with the with the arms that I currently have? Because I need to work on my abilities. Wire snatch, good, 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 good. Increase the range of my grab grab hand abilities. Getting more orbs, nice. Increase the range of which you can grab orbs. That's an attractive feature, you know. That's something I need to do in like my pastime, you know. It allows me to be a better man. If I can reach out to those who need my claw. My gimpy ass claw. I'm out of overtures and I'm out of... Okay, so I think we can definitely just like go into the next mission with only... Um, hold on. What did Nico suggest? I can go with, I can equip, I can equip what she suggests and then I can just pick up, um, things as I go.
you know, just to make it more fun. What better way than to, like, simply... Alright, I'm gonna go with what she suggests. I don't have a power... I don't have a... I don't have a punchline. But it's gonna be fun just to figure out how well I can play with what I currently got. And with what Devil Breakers I can pick up on the road. He's a very... He's a Swiss army knife because he has an arm for every situation. Let's go into this mission right now and just see where we can get from here. This is a very attractive mission and I'm really enjoying what we are doing on this channel and on this Twitch channel. Both Twitch and YouTube, you know. Both channels are very dear to my heart and I'm doing the very best to provide good work and commentary even if no one else is watching. How is Nico gonna get back in Not that that was ever an option. and help me out? Yeah. Time for some payback. Nico, how are you gonna drive the car through this oh, eggshell? Just you wait, you big bastard. I'll drag you all the way down there. Okay. So who are we chasing down here? That's the question. So there's no arms that can grab right away. Okay, basic overture. Got it, 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 got it. How would a phone even like come down here, I wonder? How would it, how could we find a phone down here? Let's see. What's that we're looking? Okay, cool. Oh, okay. Nothing here I can grab. Alright, that's fine. Nico's really. I really like Nico as a character. Boop, booply boop a doop. And there we go. It's pretty easy once. I'm not trying to beat very stylish, I'm just trying to get through the game. But never stood a chance. You know, yeah, you're right, you know, but like the thing is like as much as I love this game, I'm not entirely focused on the idea of like being the stylish most combo. This is a pretty combo savvy game, but I really like the story plot and like the action that comes from it, so it's not so much It's not so much that I don't know how to play the game and be so stylish. It's more like it doesn't align. That's my ride. 
It doesn't allow. I that's not my playing style. I hack and slash because I like this game. If I don't do the combos appropriately, then that's not my fault. Can you can you give me red? Can you give me red? Oh boy, two D action. 2D side scroller, oh boy. Oh no, I did not do that correctly. So I can actually touch it, okay. It's over here, good. Okay, that's good. Gotta go this way now. Cool. What was that for? Okay, let's see. Here. Okay, hold on. I get it. I think I get it. There we go. We got more orbs. Orbly orbs. Orb orbs. Put a singer. I guess that's our way up. Blood streams. These con conduits snakes through the Quilfoth, transporting blood gathering. Offer yourself to the flow, it will carry you deeper. There's no turning back one to enter. Okay. This go? Let's look around. Oh, there's Rawhide. Cool, might need that arm, you know. Gotta get into the mission prepared, you know, yo. Gotta enter and like get all gross and everything. Yeah. So disgusting again. This is still so very disgusting, oh god. Oh dear. There's no much turning back anyways when you're a demon hunter, right? This is the punchline. Ooh. I already got Rawhide anyways. I've been wanting to use punchline anyways. Punchline is a very fun thing of mine. Can you not? Damn, all the way down. Yeah. 
Okay, cool. Okay, cool. There we go. All right, we are pretty good for a boop -a looper And we got to raise back up, I hope. Or is there another way around, I guess? Oh well, silly be. Ooh, another arm. More overtures, not too bad. So we could have. All right, going down is the only way, huh? Look at all that bloodlust. What's the worst that can happen, you know, yo? Okay, let's see where do we go. Down this way, follow the bloodline. Okay, what's gonna go on now? Ice. Hello, Satan. Hello, Ice Brethren. Hello, Sheep. Hello, Baphomet. Baphomet. Okay, can you not do that? Okay, cool, that's not nice. We're in, we're going to another blood vein, into another blood vein. Also, fun fact, there is a anime blood board coming out basically, basically called code, uh, code vein or blood vein, but I'm excited to play it later on down the road and I'm excited to not die as much, hopefully, because I'm practicing as much as I can with other souls like game. Is there a weapon behind you like usual? Nope, no weapon behind me. Behind you or me. Let's enter the Quilfoth at this point. Maybe we'll find Dante this way. Because in all of the Devil May Cry game, there's only ever been like 20 chapters total. So we'll see where this goes. Ooh, that looks attractive. That is a save point.
uh, Divine Statue. Oh my gosh. So this Divine Statue is nostalgic. And Nico has it. So I don't know why she has it. But we have it here. Let's see if we can survive. Have I equipped all the skills? I want... Let's learn that. Let's see what happens. Because like the skill later is going to be very fun with like max act. I need to learn... I need to learn um, pay line and midair press. I can, it's a diagonal dive. That's cool. I need to learn, wait, hard way. Cool. Caliber. Okay. Caliber is interesting. But I definitely want to get these two soon. More blue orbs, hopefully. 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 Let's see if we can't fight this boss well. Oh boy. Because the whole attractiveness of Overture is actually sticking your arm into the opponent, so like. It fights that way, but let's see what happens. A demon in the rough. Dodging, excuse me. Did you die? And I'm still stuck here with Proto Angelo and the Angelo boys. I only have one, two arms left. Okay, I'm out of arms.
Okay, can you not do that for me? Okay, can you do that real quick and die? I did not do that appropriately, but I won. I barely won, and I have no more arms. Ooh, I'm in trouble. I'm in deep trouble. Oh, I go, oh, I jump over, okay. I gotta go this way because there's money over there. I'm out of arms. I'm severely out of arms. Like, I cannot do any specials anymore because I have no arms. I'm Stubby R. McGee. Maybe an arm hidden here? Nope, just my money. More big money bags. Big money dick bags. How far am I going within the quilt fog? How much deeper have I gone? So I got an arm. Can I get more arms before we go to the boss fight thing? We're in the boss fight thing. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Right on. We are on the social queue. Or the active queue. Again, I got only one arm. I lost a couple arms and we came back with one. Maybe there's another one here. Yeah, there's no extra arm. Sad life. Sad monkey life. Like for 15 more bucks, I can have like the um, the pre-order upgrade. That's pretty nice, if only. I go up or behind me? I go up. So what's over here? Just another way to fall down? Okay. Let's fall down and see what happens. There's God. Oh, there's just treasure. And another arm. That's a nice skill too. What's this mission? Get to the goal without touching the ground. Okay. I can...
possibly nigh. I can possibly try that. Let's see what happens. Oh, my back. Just gotta crack my back. And I recently popped like something underneath my rib cage, so it's gonna be a while before I feel like any kind of healthy. All right, so that's the mission. I just gotta glide on through without touching the floor. Okay. And the goal is for the blue orb right over there. Fork. I thought it was easy. I thought I had it. It should be simple enough though, shouldn't it? Fork! So maybe I am undermining what this entails. One more time. One more time, let's see. Okay. No, cool. Okay. No, oh God. No, I thought I had it. I was so very close. But I think the reaction time is just like really bad. That's all. But it's okay. I have poor reaction skills. And I still like stuffed myself. That's okay. More orbs, nice. Guess we gotta go this way now. This feels all too familiar when we almost fought and defeated um Queez uh Yurizan. Okay, cool. Not too bad. Oh, cool. Another shard. Yes, 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 yes. Let's go inside. We're going to go into the bloodline and let's see where Dante could be. Wait, so do we actually think that the quote that we're at the part where we can fight Urizen? Does it still work? Can she actually get the car up here somehow? I don't believe that she could. That she can get the car up there. I think it's hard to believe. So, think you can make it all the way here? And she's actually a scared little child, which is okay. How did she get the car up there? Are you going to try to hit me? Or did you cut up the uh, evidence before you found out? Before she found out? Or something. I don't know. How did how did how did Nico get the car up there? I swear. This is just like dumb. No. What do you mean no?
Let's see what we already have. So we have, let's remove. Hmm. It's not too bad. That's not going to be useful though. So let's see. Let's try this out for the first time because I've never played it before. I just need to get a good I just need to get a good shot in and then we're good to go. But let's go back in because I need to get another skill, which I forgot to grab. Forgot to grab another skill. She's so cool. Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool. That's so cool. Yes, I am. I mean, let's be fair, Nico. Am I allowed to hit on you because you've been with me this entire time? Because, like, you're a lonely girl, I'm a lonely guy, and we need to, like, maybe procreate in the event that I die so my kids will move on and attain power like my dad? Dante Daddy? <laughs> Daddy Dante? So the only problem with like having like Tombo is that I can't actually grapple. Fork! I didn't mean to do that! Nico! I fucked up! I didn't mean to do that, I swear. I forked. I completely forked. Ah, oh, my, my. Oh, so I came from that way. Wait, no, I came from that way. So what's over here then? Because they shot a gun. I shot the sheriff. But I ain't shoot no deputy. What 
What's up here? Okay, cool. That's pretty good. Pretty fun. Oh, God. Okay, there's nothing in there. Nothing in those. I was hoping to leave some orbs or something, because I'm low on health. A little bit. There you go, burn away, burn away. Think it's good to be king, huh? Not for much longer. I'm gonna dethrone you when I only just got back a robotic arm. What's the worst that can happen, right? I got health. Now I can take you. Let's see what happens the second time around. Tomboy. I'm using Tomboy right now. That's pretty cool. Hey, douchebag. Miss me? Where's Dante? No body? Dried up Dante jerky? Nothing? You come here to die. He does. Your reason, huh? I bet your parents didn't like you much, because your name sucks. I am without a name. I am power. Absolute. Well, no name. I'll be sure to put that on your tombstone. You will suffer and die. I'll show you. Okay, so clearly, oh god. Oh god. Come on, no, okay, come on. Can you not? Okay, clearly not the best thing I could have done. And I died. Oh god, okay.
Can I, can I, can I dodge? I get, I get no bricks, do I? Break the shield, right? No, don't, no, 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 no. Okay, that's not attractive, Tyler. That is not attractive. Okay, cool. I broke the shield, so now what? I cut your hand, and I'm knocked out. Clear. It's about time I landed something. Weak mortal. Demon power does not course through your veins. Yet you try. How dare you strike me? I do dare. You know, because you're in my house a little bit, you know? Like, it's attractive that you think it's your house, but... What are you opening up? That's the biggest question I got today. Okay, you're clearly taller than I thought you'd be. Okay, so you clearly healed and you're out of your bloodbath. Okay, come on. And can you not? Okay, can you not? Can you can you let me Can you can you not? Can you not? Nowhere to go. Fork! And I was I was supposed to die apparently. Okay, I was supposed to lose. That makes kind of sense. No tentacles. I clearly know where this is going. And please do not. Uh, you're touching me with your tentacles. That's not very attractive. Please. Can you not? Okay, what's going on here? Who did that? I wonder who did that. 
Dante. That's Sparta, apparently, I guess, or whatever. What creature stands against a king? Yes. Damn it. And of course, you black out. All right. So I didn't do very well, I don't think, because like a lot of it was just survival. And then when he stood up, I could actually just die and let it be. So I don't think I've used my resources appropriately. With V determined to seek out Sparta, Nero went on his own to confront the demon alone. Just when he seemed on the brink of revenge, Yuri Zen unleashed an unseen level of power. All seemed to lost until an unfamiliar demon with blazing red eyes rushed in and beat back the demon's assault. So... Who is the mysterious character, the mysterious demon that's in our doorstep? So this is a flashback episode? Alright, flashback it is. A few weeks ago, this happened a few weeks ago. He could have at least knocked Morrison. Some good news and some bad news. Pick your poison. Which you want to hear first? <sighs> Just speak. Bad news it is. Lady Patty's feathers are all ruffled. See, she wants to invite you to her birthday party, but your phone is disconnected. <laughs> You're a smart one, Morrison. You notice the electric and water out too? I expected nothing less. <laughs> so what's the good news? Oh, I got a gig. Cash up front. Cash up front? This I like. The water needs turning on and those toilets need flushing. Water, gas, and power. Coming out of your cut. You're a real agency now. A real agency. Devil may cry. Dante, Dante, don't any idea how many times I've tried to call? Like a billion. Oh my god, tonight's my birthday party. Yeah, I'm turning 18. Not a little kid. <clears throat> okay, Morrison, I'll take you up on that gig, but only. If you can get me out of that hellish birthday party. <laughs> can steal RSVP declined. Meet your new client. Listen, Ooh. I'm going to find Lady and Trish. Bring him in on this. What? Come on. You don't think I can handle this gig on my own? It's a big job. Big job, Dante. You're going to need the help. So, what's your name? I have no name. I am but two days old. Just kidding. You can call me V. Okay, V. Why don't you tell me everything about this job? A powerful demon is about to resurrect and... We need your help, Dante. <laughs> now that's a familiar tune. Do you have any idea how many times I've heard that exact same line? This is special. Special? Okay. So what's so special about this one? This demon is your reason. Your reason for fighting. This demon got a name? Okay, so we have a clear motive for Dante. Okay. He said the magic words. Virgil. Virgil. Virgil is the only reason he ever like has like a serious fight and big fight nowadays. With V determined to seek out Sparta, Nero, and... Okay, so we're going more into like what's been going on in the backgrounds during the events that we play as 
Um, during the events that we play as uh, Dont uh, Nero. So I think at this point, we are backtracking a little bit because V's on the lookout for... V's looking out for... Um, for... What is it? The Demon Sword Sparta. And a lot of what predicates into these current events re is regarding to and is in dire need of Dante. But for some reason, Dante is missing and so is Trish. So we need to figure out what's happened to Trish, what's happened to Dante, and we need to figure out where V plays in all of this. So I'm going to end the stream. I'm going to take a break from streaming for now. But for those of you on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please press the like button. Please subscribe for more notifications on the next time Devil May Cry comes into your doors. And when the next time we're playing any game that you like from Spider-Man to Devil May Cry to whatever you like to watch. And if this came out after the charity stream from March 16th, I hope you enjoy the stream. We are trying our very best to provide you content for you to watch. And, you know, enjoy the show. So as always, my name is Wiltafu, I'm your friend, and I'll see you next time. Bye. And for everyone on Twitch, I'll be right back. Maybe, hopefully, we'll see what happens. Ooh, wrong one.